the Nigerian Red Cross Society has launched an emergency appeal in order to raise 10 billion naira for flood victims across the country as part of humanitarian support. The Vice President of the International Federation of the Red Cross, Bolaji Anani, made this appeal during the Red Cross Central Council annual general meeting which held in Abuja. He said there is a need for citizens to support the society effort aimed at reaching out to flood victims across the country. Nigeria suffers from multiple humanitarian crises um, here in Nigeria. In the Northeast, the crisis has been now a decade long. Um, and then we have increasingly seen the crisis in, in Northwest and North Central, where the food insecurity is growing. And of course, uh, we now see the crisis of floods in, in many parts of the, the country, especially in the southern part of the country. And in many of these cases, uh, whether it is because of floods or whether it is because of uh, violence or whether it is because of, uh, um, you know, economic situation of poverty, uh, people get displaced or they migrate, which meaning that they lose their space where they usually stay and they tend to move and that increases their vulnerability, their vulnerability to access to food, to access to clean water and access to sanitation and of course protection for women and children in particular. Uh, in their new environments. Farms have been eroded, houses have been taken over, roads have been, er I mean, uh, washed away. So this is becoming a very immediate emergency. For this purpose, we have launched a 10 billion naira appeal across the world. I'm appealing to Nigerians to come to the aid of their fellow Nigerians that are in their needs. Many people have been affected by this conflict, which has been compounded by the floods, by the COVID-19, and so many things. So many people actually are improvised are improvised in, in Nigeria. And I think we as Nigerians should have the courage, should have the commitment to support our fellow Nigerians. From Nigerians, we are still building and trusting. Meanwhile, we are getting more support from outside Nigeria. And we are trying to explain to Nigerians that we are doing this here with what other outsiders are giving to us. And we trust that Nigerians, especially the corporate world, will support us to carry out more of our efforts towards helping the people.